Well, good morning. SWAT officers have been out here now since very late last night, early this morning. They are still here. They've really gathered a couple of blocks from where we're standing now near 96th and South Perry. They are there are rather still several streets that are blocked off near 95th and the Dan Ryan as they continue with this standoff. There is some video. This is some video that we shot about 90 minutes ago. They've been concentrating their efforts around 96 and Perry. This all started late last night when there was reports of a man walking around with a gun. Officers did take a man into custody, but right now we don't know exactly if that person had anything to do with the current SWAT situation. We do know the FBI and CPD are assisting Madison police. Earlier this month, a warrant was issued for a 43-year-old Chicago man, Lander Coleman. Police say he shot his ex-girlfriend and her two kids. All three survived. Law enforcement, however, has not confirmed it is Coleman in this standoff. Now, we have been keeping close contact with uh, police and law enforcement, including the FBI. We do expect to get more information a little later on this morning. We are live near 95th in the Dan Ryan. I'm Eric Rung, WGN News.